have we talked about your day job on this show before? Likely. <laughs> We've spoken about, about a lot of stuff. So yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm beginning to get lost of what we have spoken about. That's true. But... Um, I mean, and also because we're friends in real life that we've also had conversations outside of the podcast and been like, so I know things about you. That, Are we uh, letting people behind the curtain? Well, only we, because... The, we're, the, we're friends. <laughs> <laughs> the thing I want to talk about today is the most targeted ad ever. If you just bring up that link, right? Mm. Um, and this is, it's like a targeted online ad. I think it was on Facebook or whatever. Uh, but you do this in your day job. You're an online marketer. Yeah, I'm a digital of... marketer, yeah. So I, I do Google and things. Do you do, uh, do, you do Facebook ads? There's Facebook and YouTube and all that sort of stuff. Cool. I'm, okay. the, I'm, the, one, I'm the one that riddles your visitors with... Uh, with oh, God, with yeah. Four <laughs> ads uh, a time they watch Wait, one of wow, your videos. Wait, that's, that's, wow, yeah, that's true. That's me. Have you, do you do YouTube ads? Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. I didn't know, like video ads or yeah, just the inlays? Oh, that's cool. Uh, video ads and the inlays go go hand in hand. You you do one, you do the other. So I don't even know that. Yeah. All I know is it's all done automatically for me, and it's wonderful. <laughs> wow, that's cool. I had no, I didn't realize you were doing YouTube ads. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay, how much do you pay for those? Depends. Depends. It's, it's similar to how like uh, oh, yeah, it depends who you're targeting. What exactly. The ad depends is, where you're targeting. Who, sure. if, if if it's something like, for instance, personal finance is really expensive. Dude, whereas the guys doing personal finance on YouTube make a fortune because oh my because God. they make a fortune because the marketers on the other side pay a fortune yeah but they're cpms so say i'll make a cpm of like for the non-market that is the cost per mil sorry yes cost good per point. thousand visitors yeah so if someone watches viewers. a thousand if someone views a thousand a video a thousand times i'll make maybe three four dollars mm-hmm. personal finance guys make 15 what yeah that's a lot of money so even with like a couple of hundred thousand subscribers those guys are making bank bang dude i'm like i want to start a personal making finance coin. channel just because i'm a greedy bastard so, i don't know man there's there's so much of it's american focus though mm. and it's like oh you got to do this with your real estate or get this credit card or put this on your taxes and i'm like well i can't get american credit cards the tax system's obviously completely different and so is real estate so it's like okay yeah, uh, I, I've I've always found that with these sorts of videos that like um, things like Gary V and uh, Grant Cardone and all that they're amazing to watch, but it only really works for an American audience in yeah. that way. Like it's it doesn't translate to other countries who just don't have that same um, kind of level of enthusiasm. Uh, for... Well, it's not just enthusiasm. Uh, enthusiasm is fine, but the legal system and stuff is, uh, and all the way the systems yeah. works, it's just really different. True, true. And I don't know, whatever it is, like I feel like. Uh, Gary V. I don't know Grant Cardone, but like, I mean, I know of him, but mm. I think he's a bit of a dick. Um, oh, he is, but he's a very rich dick. <laughs> <laughs> that's true. Um, but that's kind of a bit more internationally relevant because it's generally more about business, at least Gary Vaynerchuk. Mm. Um, yeah, sort of. I don't know. I don't really follow the stuff super heavily. Uh, anyway, back to ads. Uh, this guy, he does the most. And you're gonna to have to jump in and tell me where i'm going wrong because i don't know anything about this mm. but essentially he plays an epic prank so he has a roommate who's this is a great read on uh, what's the website ghostinfluence.com yeah uh so this guy gets a roommate and they you know live together or whatever and he's a digital marketer and his friend his roommate is a professional sword swallower which yeah. is the thing. Oh, oh I, maybe he does it. He's professional at it, but I think he has a job as well and That's whatever. different. So he gets pranked and he wants to get in back. So he's a professional sword, sword swallower, but funnily enough, he can't swallow pills. Like he has a real trouble like taking an, an ibuprofen or something and, you know, or, you know, taking any sort of drugs. So this guy, the digital marketer, creates an ultra-targeted Facebook ad for him, which basically, uh, if you scroll down, apparently there's some images. I made some notes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. So he goes into like the Facebook thing. Scroll down, scroll down. I think there's like a, an actual picture of the ad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it says, trouble swallowing pills. And then the sub thing says, does it seem ironic that swallowing swords is easy and then small pills make you gag? <laughs> and so this guy starts freaking out, being like, whoa, Facebook got amazing at like advertising to me and he sends he talks to his roommate like through messages being like dude i just saw this advert this is so crazy and basically the guy had like because i think on facebook you can't individually target someone no but he basically like just worked out 
he was like okay so i want people in this region of this age mm-hmm. group of this and then ah the big trick was apparently tell me if this is true or not mm. um or how it works you'll probably know you upload a database of people's email addresses mm-hmm. right yep. you put it in the system and then it has to be like quite large but then he managed to introduce like rules that whittled down this database with his roommates you know details in to like it being so a that only one person yeah, can be that person target yeah. audience size of one. Oh. and then he put this advert out to him and i was like that is absolutely genius and he did it for like weeks and he really thought he was being spied on and then he got yeah 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 and then <laughs> zoom right in on that I've one just i've just jumped forward in in, in yeah, the, yeah yeah so it says we heard you swallow so you like swallowing things you're in luck because we have an amazing deal for you and uh, it's blurred out but it's obviously a picture of a dildo <laughs> um so yeah these ads got super specific the guy gets absolutely freaked out and eventually it just gets so silly and extreme <laughs> like well, the- are you a strong top question mark if you're the kind of coffee drinking guy who has a black bandana in his pocket watch me it's like, <laughs> so <laughs> it's just so specific and eventually he figures it out <laughs> this is a beautiful troll i think this is fantastic actually. Dude, like you've if- got to use your powers to do this on like someone not on me. <laughs> <laughs> but like on someone you. well we were talking last episode you were looking for pranks and stuff yeah dude use your skills use something skills. like this there's got to be something out there like that is like this what i love is that he's paying <laughs> he's paying money for this like this is a what's that what are you laughing it, at? it ends up really cheap but just scroll up i must have missed this one i think this must have been the last one and it says hey his name which is blanked <laughs> out ever feel like your roommate is creating facebook ads targeted to a niche of just you so i think that's how he gave it away in the end nice uh, i think that's great actually i really enjoy that <laughs> yeah it's pretty good right no, I th- I, yeah it, it is crazy how like usually with with google ads you're trying to target like uh, sorry with with facebook you're trying to kind of target like a group of people but it's i'd never thought of using it as this like targeting one single person. person that's that's really unique a sword swallow who can't swallow pills god good right that's beautiful yeah i love that that's really good <laughs> yeah